Hello everyone, thank you for joining us on this week. We have Function Consulting Friend to Servers. And uh, for this week, uh, we're going to talk about the education industry and a very great brand from the U.S. called Bricks for Kids. And to learn more about this brand, I invited Mr. Robert, our Director of Business and Development, uh, to come and talk about it first. So, uh, Mr. Robert, thank you for joining us today. Thank you, Mandy, and thanks everyone for watching this video. So, Mr. Robert, can you give us a short introduction of Bricks for Kids? Sure. Well, Bricks for Kids is the world's largest STEM-based education franchise. And uh, for those people who don't really know what STEM is, uh, basically it's an educa it's education in uh, science, technology, engineering, and math. So that's really the, the skill that they focus on. And they do this uh, training or teaching using the world's most popular toy, Legos. So they have, yeah, yeah. Amazing, they have an amazing program uh, for franchisees, uh, both with small territories or larger territories. And they have a very, very low investment as a startup cost, which means this really opens it up to small and medium level companies, uh, medium size companies. Uh, they don't have to be someone who, you know, is a very large uh, business or a very large uh, investor. Uh, yeah. Their program really has a quite fast return on investment. And at the yeah. same time, it helps kids in your city or in your territory uh, better at probably the world's four most important foundational skills. Yeah. Okay, so, I got it. You know, what could be better, right? Yeah, that's correct, though. So, uh, yeah, as you already mentioned, the STEM model has already been familiar, familiar with many countries around the world. So what makes Brick for Kids unique? You know, if I had to summarize it into one word, it would be yeah. fun. You know, it, it's not easy to teach children important fundamentals, especially yeah. you know, very young children in a way that they, that they really enjoy. So with Bricks for Kids, the children just think they're playing. Uh, but as a teacher and a parent, you know, you know that you're learning, that they're learning very important things. Uh, they have other things, too, that make them special. They have these uh, really unique mobile units, uh, sort of like a, a large suitcase, that lets them run activities for about 20 students uh, in really? areas. Yeah. So wow. you're not just running classes in your centers, uh, but you can actually do them uh, wherever there's space. So classes can be offered at schools, community centers, common rooms, virtually anywhere where, you know, a small space could be uh, arranged uh, with some local uh, property. So, you know, many people have a, a game, probably in most people's area, they do have some game centers in retail mm -hmm. stores where they might have Legos, they might have other different, um, you know, games and such things where children can go and play. So that's really not that unique. Mm -hmm. But that's not yeah. really comparable to Bricks for Kids. Bricks for oh, Kids okay. is offering classes. Uh, mm -hmm. where specific activities are done for all mm -hmm. ages of kids. Uh, they have their, their STEM-based lessons. Uh, yeah. They use a teacher, and they yeah. pull it all through, you know, their app right on people's phones um, mm -hmm. with specific times, specific dates, specific subjects. And, and parents can just register their kids, you know, right on their phone uh, and then take them to those classes. Of course, they do allow walk-ins to their centers for, you know, kids that just want to come and play. Uh, for a few hours, uh, but that's not really their prime focus and business model. Yeah, so uh, sim I, I heard a lot of um, information. I heard a lot of people saying that uh, Prefocus like, is a very popular brand in the market, but um, is that true? 
And can you give me further information to prove this point? Because I'm curious. I want to have information from an expert, like from your point of view. And um, um, also, would you please give me further information about what will BrickFocus do to support the franchisee? I want to operate a great model just like them. Yeah. Sure. So great questions. Well, yes. you know, Mindy, kids everywhere need to learn STEM. So science, again, science, technology, engineering, and math. And, and those four subjects kind of are the foundation of most of today's jobs. Most jobs in the world today uh, use those four things as a foundation. Uh, and, you know, there's lots of centers around that teach English, uh, which, of course, is a very important skill. But there's not really any centers around that teach STEM. And, and kids everywhere love Legos. So you've got something that kids love to do with skills that they really find that they really need to learn and get better at. Uh, and you put them together and you simply have a successful business model. That's that's really the foundation, and you know it's not a young brand. They've been around for decades. Uh, they're in more than 20 countries. They have hundreds of franchisees. So we know that the program works and has done, uh, you know, been successful for many years. And yeah. their success is because of their flexibility. So the master franchisee can make a lot of the decisions about pricing about which classes to offer, what days yeah. and times to run those classes, where to have them. Uh, all of those things really help a uh, franchisee localize the brand to their market um, and, and to fulfill the needs of the parents and the kids in their local territories. So Brick's Kids um, really will offer the franchisees a whole franchise kit uh, they'll train them to run the business, and they really kind of handhold uh, their new franchisees for the first, first month or so. Uh, basically, they're there on a daily basis just to help you through all of the challenges and the issues of any new business. Uh, and they'll give you great ongoing support as well. Whenever you need anything extra, they're there to support. They have a dedicated, well-qualified team. And of course, they continually add new things to the brand. So they're always looking for new activities, um, for new avenues and new revenue streams for their franchisees. So they've added quite a few over the last few years, and they'll continue to do so you know, year on year on year. So you always have something fresh uh, to really shake the public. Oh, this is so great. I I I start to feel something already. So um, if someone wants to see this amazing opportunity, what do you want to work? Yeah, you know, I, I think I agree with you. I think this brand is going to be very exciting. Uh, a lot of our international brands require a, a huge investment, um, and they're great opportunities. But you know, they're really only attractive for very, very large companies or big investors. Bricks for Kids really brings it down to something almost any, you know, person uh, who is, has been successful in the past or any small or medium company, you know, is going to be able to get a, a Bricks for Kids territory and actually get started with this concept. So I think it's very exciting. Uh, to get more information, it's very simple. Just send us an email. Uh, so contact us mm -hmm. at at vfranchiseconsultant.com. I will happy to send you a presentation, Bricks for mm -hmm. Kids. I will you to schedule a call with you to answer all of your questions, mm -hmm. to talk about your specific territory uh, and how we can see it being successful there. Uh, and then, of course, you know, we'll collect uh, non disclosure and application if you're looking to move forward. Mm -hmm. uh, and we'll just keep the steps going until you launch your first store. Uh, okay. So, yeah, thank you, Mr. Robert, for the information about Bridge for Kids. And everyone, there are still many great videos about Bridge for Kids on VF Function and Sultan YouTube channel. Um, so uh, please remember to hit subscribe or like our video to get further information about 
friend or the franchising opportunity say okay thank you thank you man right, everyone. Thank everybody you. have a great day My background is in education. I went to Stetson University and my bachelor's degree in elementary education. I think what really sets Bricks for Kids apart from other similar programs is that we really do have a lot of diverse offerings. Our after-school programs and our in-school workshops, they definitely really hit on the educational aspect of what we have to offer. Our tagline is we learn, we build, we play with Lego bricks. So no matter what, they're going to be learning something. They're going to be building something. And of course, they're going to have fun playing with it. Bricks for Kids has a great impact on the kids themselves, of course. By the time they get here and start building, it's all about the fun. And a lot of times, they don't even realize they're learning. Because after the lesson, and then during the build, there's always just an informal discussion between the instructor and the kids. So they're learning what they just talked about in the lesson, what was just presented to them. And then they're learning as they're building in a very very hands-on fashion. After they learn to build new projects, there is such a sense of accomplishment that they get from it at the end. They develop more of a more of an interest and more passion for architecture and engineering and just how things are put together and the way that things work. And I think it definitely helps them develop their own understanding of how much they can do and accomplish and also where their own interests lie. Teamwork and cooperation and collaboration are big factors, especially in camps. Sometimes they'll be around the same age level, sometimes it'll be mixed age groups. It is a good way to kind of get kids in those social groups that they otherwise might not have that opportunity during the regular school day. Breaks for Kids is going to give your child the opportunity to really learn new information that they don't get in the regular classroom setting. We have all sorts of activities, model builds, and lessons that focus on each aspect of science, technology, engineering, and math. In addition, they're developing friendships through the social interaction that comes with the programs through the camps, the after school classes, and all the other different diverse programs we have to offer. The feedback from parents is very positive and that's why they keep sending their kids back year after year.